Hello everyone, what's going on? I am Carlos, I'm a normal guy trying to make wealth for my family. I feel that this is one of the most important videos that I have ever made so far. Please watch until the end. Earlier I made a video that shows evidence from the blockchain that Celsius could be buying sell tokens in the market in centralized exchanges such as FTX, Gate.io and others and redistributing these tokens to the customers that have their funds frozen, locked in the sell platform. I had some afterthoughts about it and I want to explain what these afterthoughts are to you. Before that though, I want to show you a small section of my video from earlier to set the scene so that you can understand better what I'm going to be talking about. I came across this very interesting tweet from the privateer. He's checking the facts. Did Celsius Network actually purchase sell tokens to distribute it last Monday? According to his check, yes, they did on FTX, OKX, Bitfinex, and Gate.io. Sell tokens bought in all these four exchanges ended up in the same wallet. In the tweet, he says that he can't really guarantee anything, but the collection address was last used solely to collect sell from these exchanges and it was sent to Celsius Wallet 5, which is a sell user balance wallet. This can be checked in the EAT scan. You can see it over here. These purchases, or short squeeze as you prefer, have been happening for a few days. Would Celsius have funds to keep purchasing more sell tokens for another week? Celsius distributes their rewards every Monday. There isn't a set time, but normally it's like Monday morning in Europe. I'm in Asia right now, so it's normally Monday evening for me, or occasionally happens to be in the middle of the night on Tuesday or first thing in the morning on Tuesday for me. Guess when on the week these pumps were? Monday to Tuesday. Monday to Tuesday. Interesting, isn't it? So it's not news for anybody that Celsius has been struggling with illiquidity. Then they stopped withdrawals, they stopped the transfers, the price of the sell token went down. A lot of people shorted the sell token because they understood that the fundamentals of the sell tokens were no longer there. Then as shown in this video, Celsius went and removed the liquidity from the market. Why did they do that? It was a very dirty but ingenious move from Celsius. First, they squeezed all the short positions, which then got liquidated in a cascade effect. The price pumped very quickly. And this happened on Monday, the day that Celsius had to pay the rewards for those $12 billion that are still locked in their platform. A lot of the customers choose to earn their rewards in sell tokens because they earn a little bit more in percentage uh, if they earn their rewards in sell tokens. But with the price of the sell token significantly higher in comparison to a few hours prior, less tokens, less sell tokens are needed to make up the same dollar value. Let me give you a quick example to help you understand. Let's say you should be earning $10 in rewards every Monday, and you have chosen to earn your rewards in sell tokens to earn a little higher percentage in your rewards. Uh, if the sell token costs $2, Celsius just needs to pay you five sell tokens for your weekly rewards. Whereas if the sell token costs $1, Celsius needs to pay you 10 sell tokens to make up your $10 weekly reward. So here we had the price on Monday the 14th, then the rest of the week. Here we had the price on Monday the 20th, then the rest of the week. Does this surprise you? This is dirty, old-style Wall Street manipulation. They pump the price on Monday, pay your rewards, knowing that they will dump the price on Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, etc. And then next Monday, when they need to pay you again, they'll probably pump the price again. I would appreciate if you could like the video, though if you are a Celsian and you disagree with me, I understand if you choose to not like the video. Um, if you watch my previous videos, I have been saying that I believe in Alex Mashinsky, I believe that Celsius is going to recover. Um, I kind of believe that what has happened to Celsius was a articulated attack from some big players 
though I have no way of proving if it is true or not. But I need to tell you what I can see with my own eyes. And what I can see is that Celsius is trying to be smart when it comes to paying rewards, which is really not fair with the investors who don't know if or when they will be able to touch their assets again. To be honest with you, I think they should just stop paying rewards altogether. If they can honor withdrawals, why pay rewards? It doesn't make sense to me. Again, I'm not taking sides. This is not financial advice. I'm just telling you what I can see right in front of my nose. If you're new to the channel, leave that like. Even if you didn't like, leave that like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.